Welcome back. You tune into Expresso here on SABC3. Now, last week we discussed uh, the symptoms of headaches, what causes headaches, how you can treat headaches. If you missed that insert, you can get it on your phone uh, at Expresso Show. So it's at www.expressoshow.mobi. You can watch that insert. And we had so many questions about headaches and migraines that Franta Katz from Pick and Pay Pharmacy is back to answer your migraine related questions. Good morning and welcome morning. to Expresso. Thank you. Now, I've heard that more than 30 million Americans uh, get headaches. A yeah. migraine, should I say, and more women than men yes. get migraines. And we posted the question on our Twitter account at Expresso Show yesterday to ask if anyone had any questions for you today. And uh, I thought I'd start with this one because it's the perfect one that I had as well. From Londi, her Twitter name, at Queen and Glovo, what causes migraine? Um, nobody is 100% sure what the cause of migraine headaches are, but there are two theories. Um, the one theory being that blood vessels that feed the main part of the brain goes into spasm. And then after a period of time, those blood vessels relax again. So when it goes into spasm, there is a decreased amount of blood flow to the brain. When it relaxes, there's a sudden influx of, of blood into the brain area. And that seems to be one of the reasons why. The other reason um, is that your neurotransmitters, which is dopamine and serotonin, has an effect on the blood vessels in that area. And um, Espresso is coming to Durban. Take a look at this. 